now I'm playing in Minecraft 20W03A, which is the first snapshot of 2021. You can see F3 is 21W03A. I'm not gonna say 20W something. So, right, right now I'm currently. This is a new. This is a new world called the showcase. But actually, I'm just doing a showcase. So, on the first item, now on, on addition, we have the the first item is a glow item frame. So you can have a item frames. So you can make a glow by using this glow ink sack. You can put a crafting table. Put this down here. It it gets us glowing sack go item frame right over here. For this over here, you can when you put this down here, you see it's glowing. But if you put an actual item frame, it does not go right over here. And it it could go if an item is placed on there, it just it does glow. There's glow icons. Which this is right over here. They are, they have a light level of seven, and they're found rarely, naturally found rarely in caves. You can obtain it with shears, and you they, they don't spread it, but you, you can use bone meal to spread it. See, like, if you put this, we're going to go into the caves, going to, to go into spectator mode. Let me go into a random cave. See, you can see it's right over here. You can waterlog it, you can place it in the water. And you can use a bone meal. You can bone meal this. I already talked to, to y'all about the glow ink sack and there's already a glow squid. This is, this is very small. Let me just go back to spectator mode the goal is going to find a, find a body of water right over here goal squid over here for this goal squid if you put this down here you see it's, it's it looks cool and it does not do anything it's just like a retexture squid and you can see it's glowing actually there is a really found in a deep dark cave and the dark ocean actually that's that's this mob one from the mob boat boat from um two two thousand twenty which, which was last fall there was minecraft alive the <coughs> ghost squid got in you know, one the second pole actually the first pole the moo was there one but actually the move does not fit in the cave and cliffs update so then they just so then the cold squid ends up win winning because people actually i thought the isolager would win because the isolager is because the isolager would be an interesting mob because it's hostile and it's aggressive because the minecraft this because we, we thought that would fit for the, the mountain update and the gold squid is also c can be attacked by axolotls and you can drop a go ink sack. Does not affect the light level and it does not affect the light level. You have an axolotl over here. Can axolotl kill this go squid? See this? Got this going sack, so that's what it drops. Those are the additions. Uh, and another thing I'm going to show you are, are the changes. Where the changes are the dripstone walk now can be crafted with four pointed dripstone. So it's dripstone. One, two. Three, four, and a, let me craft it over here. You get a dripstone block. 
signs now. Let me type anything. It's like this. If you just put diet, I mean, use lime dye because it's because it's for because that's a color for Nvidia. So see what if you use this. Go and if you use this actual ink sack over here, wait, let's go somewhere dark. Let's go to the dark, deep, dark cave over here. Put a sign right over here. Let's call this nothing. I'm just gonna dye this right over here now. You can see it's readable over here. That kind of looks like the color of NVIDIA G4 so for lime. You can use ink sack to make it go darker, which is a not readable. You can put this light so it makes this right here makes can make it readable. There's also a death message that's anyone. For, that's from falling on a stalagmite. The rest of you, but, but there's us. Now that's all the ch that's all the changes I've shown you so far. So I hope you enjoy uh, enjoy this the video. Don't forget to subscribe. I think so many of y'all aren't subscribed. Like the video and turn on post notifications. And and. I'll see you guys until until my I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.